Who doesn't love a little before and after pictures of these listings? We see them on TV all the time. Well, here I am in San Jose in Cambrian, standing in front of one of my listings that we did a little fixing up before putting on the market and it paid off big time. So I'm gonna show you around. Like I said, this house is in Cambrian, four bedroom, two bath. I'm gonna tell you how much we put into it, how much I think the owner got because of that money. And that's what I'm gonna show you today, so stick around. Hi, I'm Annie Baker. I'm a realtor here in Silicon Valley and I specialize in selling houses. I help my sellers fix up the houses and get the most they can out of the sale. So today I'm standing in front of a house in Cambrian. Like I said, it's a four bedroom, two bath. It's about 2,100 square feet, has an awesome backyard with a pool and everything. So when I first met with the sellers, they had definitely put their personal touch on the house. They had updated the kitchen and the bathrooms and the, for the most part, they were beautiful. Uh, they had also put in some kind of bright pink colors. And I just know to appeal to most buyers, we kind of need to neutralize some of those things. So I'm gonna walk you through the house, show you some before and after pictures, and then I'm gonna tell you at the end how much we put in to fix it up and how much I think that money got them in their return on the sale. So ignore the clutter, they were getting ready to move to Europe, but notice the tan, brownish, there's pale yellow colored walls, Very, it just felt dated as you walked in kitchen they had redone which is bold colors with the red and their family room had purple and orange with brown floor more of the brown as you see in this entry in the yellow these original hardwood stairs were really beat up really scratched up my painters beat me to it unfortunately the kids rooms had a lot of bold like teal colors and it was just bold a lot of personality, this bright yellow with the blue, a lot of personality. Yeah, unfortunately, you didn't get to see that before, but here's the primary bedroom that had purple and lavender walls. And here's the after. Neutralize, we paint the ceilings white to make the pop. The family room, look at this neutralized. Beautiful. We put in the same flooring as the kitchen, so it blended better, and look at the kids' bathroom. So in the front, we just cleaned it all up, trimmed the trees, trimmed the bushes, added some bark, just made it feel fresh. And really, we used the same paint color throughout. It was a light, creamy gray color. We stuck with that gray flooring for downstairs. We just had to update that family room. We kept the original hardwood as you'll see in these two rooms, but with a neutral paint, fresh ceiling paint, it just really made it feel newer. Kitchen, oops. The kitchen, you know, we kept the same. It was beautiful. It's a little bold with the red, but some people really like that. But you can just tell it just flows so much better downstairs now. We added the same flooring as the kitchen. So that just flowed really well from the family room to the kitchen. New white ceilings with the light gray walls, new baseboards. And then you'll see the outside. Look at this yard with artificial grass. The pool has an outdoor kitchen with a barbecue, a fridge, a sink, gas fire pit. I mean, fantastic yard. And as I take you upstairs, you'll see we updated the stairs. We got rid we put a gray flooring to match the downstairs. Well, and here's the bathroom. We neutralized this paint as well. But these stairs look so great and updated the gray on the top with the white front. Redid all the floors upstairs neutralized all the walls so when i first met these sellers it was actually in the late spring and i told them i thought you know it's pretty hot market i thought we could get between 185 and 1.9 million and that would be on the very high side for their neighborhood we put twenty two thousand dollars in the paint the new floors upstairs stairway in the family room did a little cleanup outside and we ended up with a sale price of two million dollars so $22,000 investment got them at least $100,000 in the sale price. Even if we had pushed the market and kind of gotten a one nine, 
at the time when it had those bright paint colors. Um, I, there's no way we would have gotten 2 million. This just appealed to so many more buyers. We had bidding wars and that's how we get the prices up when we broke the price in their neighborhood. Highest sale price in their neighborhood in Cambrian, 2 million on a $22,000 investment. So what'd you think? I think neutralizing the paint colors uh, kind of actually made their bathrooms and kitchen even sort of just stand out a little bit more because they really were beautifully done. I helped cover the cost for the sellers. I put in $20,000 and to get all that work done, I managed it all. Uh, as I said in the video, my clients moved to Europe. So the house was vacant. I handled everything manage the whole project they left i covered the costs so if you're looking to fix up your house maybe you don't have the funds or you just have so much going on and you just don't even know where to begin to get your house ready i can help you love getting my sellers extra money so there you have it if you have any questions comment below text email call anything i'm here to be a resource for you so until next time have a great one